Hey guys, welcome to the Field of 68 YouTube channel. If you like what you see here, hit that subscribe button and you'll get more college basketball content just like this. Let's get to some questions here. Uh, we, we've been tallying. Producer Dagan has been a rock star tonight taking the best questions here. We're going to start with the Nate Oates situation. This is from Tony G. He says, your thoughts on the Nate Oates situation tonight against Missouri. Chris, what happened there? Well, if you didn't see it, you know, two of the players got in, in a little bit of a scuffle um, for Alabama and Missouri. I think there was elbow thrown. Nate took exception, just sort of pushed the kid back. I think they're making a big deal about nothing. You know, it's not like he shoved him two-handed and started screaming at him. I think he just was trying to separate the kid. I think if he had to do it over again, he'd probably push his kid away uh, just to make sure that cooler heads prevailed. But, you know, he apologized after the game. I think, you know, in today's world, everybody likes to make so much of, of little things, and this is about as little as it can get, in my opinion. Yeah, I think he did the right thing by yeah, yeah, he can't he did the right thing by coming out and apologizing just because um I think that uh you know, you saw the reaction to it and I do think that you could see that Dennis Gates probably didn't love that the opposing coach put a hand on his player. Um but really what had happened was Aiden Shaw was in the Alabama um huddle because of just where that scuffle kind of ended up and Nate Oates kind of just put a hand in his chest and said you're out go go back to your bench, right? Like it is what it is. I don't think there's anything too big about uh, too big of a deal about it. But um, there was a post that said that NATO shoves a player that kind of went viral a little bit. So whenever that happens, you're going to see a situation where people react to it. So yeah, yeah. for sure. Uh, my only read on the situation, gentlemen. NATO is going to look great in Ann Arbor one day. I mean, it, is there not a better coach if you can't keep your hands off the opposing program? Ain't that just a perfect oh fit for the Michigan oh guy coming back home? I mean, come on. Come on. Thank you for watching the Field of 68. If you've enjoyed what you've seen here, hit that like button, share this link with your friends, or check out the description for some other places that you can consume Field of 68 content.